What if we could merge walls together, resize fences, and also have a small grid fence? Hey, y'all, and I hope you guys are having a great day today. If you guys are not, turn that frown upside down because we're gonna be looking at some useful concepts that Bloxburg should add. We have a bunch of concepts over here from Welcome to Bloxburg News. So we're gonna take a look at all of them, talk about them, and see what y'all think. So comment below your thoughts and ideas after, at the end of this video, you know, you're gonna see what's going on and then, and then comment. Also, if you've been watching my past videos, you probably know that I moved. It's been changing ever since in the background. I finally got a couch, you guys. We got our coffee table in place. I got my rug. I also have like a, uh, a side chair. You can't see it's off camera. But, you know, we're getting situated. I might put some lights around my kitchen area over there to make it a little bit better. But the background be looking spicy. I do be liking my background, okay? She be cute. But anyways, here are some useful concepts. I feel like whenever we talk about concepts, we're like pet school, you know, the same old, same old. But here are some things that could be very useful for the building community, also just Bloxburg in general. So we have the first thing over here, some placeable foundation. So this is an adjustable raise from the ground, adds strength to your builds as well. I'm not really sure what this would exactly do to build strength. Maybe if they had natural disasters, then it would make more sense. But a foundation is basically what you put a house on in real life. Um, I don't know if this would make sense in Bloxburg though, but maybe they could put it in. I don't know. There's also a placeable porch, which is an adjust adjustable height from the ground, adjustable shape, and compatible with most fences. This just reminds me of basic shapes. I mean, literally you can do all this with basic shapes. I think it's just easier tools for people who don't know how to use basic shapes or just easier for people to think about them. Like when I look at basic shapes, I don't really think about a porch. So this could be helpful for people who want a porch, but don't really know how to make a porch and don't really think of a porch when they think of basic shapes, if that makes sense. But yeah, you can get placeable porches here. And then also there's a small grid floor. Floors can be placed with small grid, perfect for detailed landscaping, textures di direction fix, textures now face one direction only, which is very, very useful because now when you place textures, they face different directions, if you get what I mean. Let me see if I can show you what I mean by that. So we're gonna go ahead and place down a floor. And also that would be really nice. I think um, right now, as you can see, you can only place it on the big, large grid. So it would be really nice to just have a floor wherever you want. But let's go ahead and put like a weird shape down and let's add some planks to it. I feel like planks are pretty easy to spot. Yeah, right there. As you can see, right there, it's not play it's not facing one way, which is very annoying. So that would be lovely if it could get fixed. <laughs> so there's just a couple of those, and then here are a couple of more that I actually really, really like. These are my favorite ones, merge walls. I think merging walls would be really, really cool, just so you can have like two different textures on them. I think that'd be awesome. Um, you can already do that sort of by adding basic shapes or um, molding or whatever, but just merging them would be a lot easier. Um, and then we also have resizable fences, which would be so, 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 so nice, which is perfect for high, higher and load fenced platforms. I would just love some resizable fences. Right now we have a bunch of fences and some fences come in two sizes. Like the hedges over here, we got the small hedge and then also the rounded and then the, the tall rounded hedge. So we got different size hedges here, but I think it would just be easier and nicer if we could just like change the size like this one i really like this brick post fence i just wish it was shorter so i would love if i could resize my fences just an idea and then also a small grid fence would be amazing anything small grid i feel like a lot of the building things need to be small grid now like floors or roofs all of that should be able to be placed in small grid form i would love that a lot it would make life so much easier so let's see what people think about this i would love foundations and ability to resize the fences let's also get small grid wall placement and a fix where you can't interact with items through the basic shapes i actually really agree about this some small small uh, grid wall would be great. I would love a small grid wall. Yep, yep, I need all of these. They should add a resizable wall. This is everything I want in Bloxburg. Oh my gosh, smaller grid for walls as well. Let's get the ability to select slash highlight our builds and move it in the perfect spot on our lot. That would be so good, like some copy and paste, like a whole thing. Oh, please, I would love that. Please, there's so many tools, so many things that they, they can still add and I, I really need them to add it. We also have another concept over here, which is the ability to adjust grid size, ability to turn off uh, for more detailed placement, ability to set it to 10 for precise placement. So this is a different grid size. So far, we only have three grids. 
if you go into build mode over here as you can see we just have three we got the big one the medium one and the small one so in this one this concept basically you have 10 different grid sizes which is insane but like they men mentioned it would be for precise placement i think that would be very very useful low-key quite need it we need it so yeah it would be just really nice to have that so there's also some more concepts over here some improved mobile selection this frame contains drag or rotate paint duplicate resize and delete rotate is changed into a slider for convenience rather than clicking this frame also displays the item price and name this would be amazing wait i love this i love the the rotate tool being a, uh, a slider instead of like an actual rotating thing it could be used for precise stuff as well and just like this this would be so useful just click an item and all of the stuff shows up instead of having to like you know click a tool then go back to it just click an item and you can do everything in that area like you can do everything to the item right then and there which would be perfect so that that is a really good concept i really like that Beds can now resize with scale tool. That would be cool if we're gonna resize the bed, like turn a small bed into a bunk bed <gasps> or turn a bunk bed into a normal bed. Yo, that would be so cool. Also, some more concepts, expander cable box for some more television channels and some placeable pillows. Some pillows would be awesome. Right now, people do make their own pillows with the uh, rocks and beanbag chairs and basic shapes, but some placeable pillows would be super fun. And the cable box sounds really fun. Something useful-ish. I guess like not just give everyone the channels I think it would be really more realistic if you had to buy a cable box for more channels I don't know that'd be really cool and then also there's some more over here the ability to edit the wall height and the thickness of it also the thickness and the height of the floors that would be awesome as well I mean that's basically basic shapes at that point but still but yeah go check out welcome to Bloxburg news they have a lot of concepts and things like that I really like this one this is very well made as well so pretty cool stuff if you want to go check them out go do so um they're pretty cool but i hope you guys enjoyed this video of some useful concepts instead of talking about pets in school i thought we could talk about some more build mode items and things like that even though i'm not really a big builder um i think all these items would be very useful for just like hacks in general also i do build from time to time so it would be helpful for me as well um and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know your thoughts down in the comments below about these concepts because i would love to know and i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys later with another one bye